Hey children, here are the times your body was failing and you didn't notice. Number one, brain fog. If your thoughts felt slow, words kept disappearing, and your brain felt like it was buffering, that wasn't you being dumb. Your brain needs oxygen, glucose, and proper sleep to run smoothly. When any of that drops, clarity is the first thing to go. You're still awake, still functional, just not sharp. If your brain felt permanently foggy instead of clear, that wasn't laziness. That was your body struggling quietly. Number two, your heart raced to doing basic stuff. You've been sitting for a while, so you decided to stretch and walk a little. But as soon as you stand up, your heart start pounding like you've raced a marathon. And that's not normal cardio weakness. Your heart speeds up when it's trying to compensate for low blood volume, dehydration, anemia, or poor circulation. It's working harder because something else isn't pulling its weight. If everyday movements felt like mini workouts, your heart wasn't dramatic. It was covering for a system falling behind. Number three, you couldn't focus even when you tried. You sit down fully ready to work, phone away, tabs closed, and somehow your brain just refuses to lock in. You reread the same line, but you drift mid-thought and nothing sticks. That's not a discipline problem. Focus needs stable energy and balanced brain chemistry. When your body's off, attention is the first thing to suffer. You're trying, but your brain just isn't cooperating. Number four, your mood changed for no clear reason. Nothing bad happened. Life didn't suddenly fall apart, but you're more irritable, more anxious, or weirdly numb for no reason you can explain. Mood isn't just emotional, it's physical too. Blood sugar swings, sleep debt, hormones, and inflammation all affect how your brain feels. So when your personality shifts quietly, it's not random. Your body is often struggling before your mind catches on. Number five, your digestion became unpredictable. One day your stomach's fine, next day bloated, then uncomfortable again for no obvious reason. That's because your gut reacts fast to stress, poor sleep, dehydration, and internal imbalance. It's one of the first systems to show something's off. People normalize it and move on. But when digestion stops being consistent, your body isn't being annoying. It's sending warning signals. Number six, your hands or feet kept tingling. You're having weird sensation in your hands or feet, so you shake it off at first because you thought maybe you slept or sat wrong, but then it keeps happening. You felt like pressing pins down, but there's literally nothing. It's because nerves are sensitive. They react early to circulation issues, vitamin deficiencies, or nerve stress. That buzzing feeling is communication breaking down. When numbness becomes familiar instead of rare, it's not nothing. It's your body losing signal strength. Number seven, your appetite is messed up. Some days you forget to eat entirely, but other days you eat a full meal and still feel empty. Hunger isn't about discipline. It's controlled by hormones and metabolism. When those signals misfire, appetite stops making sense. And your body either doesn't ask for fuel or never feels satisfied. That's not willpower. That's regulation breaking down quietly, and it's not good. Number eight, your skin texture or color changed slightly. You didn't change products. You didn't change routines. But your skin just looks off, duller, paler, different. Skin reflects circulation, hydration, and oxygen levels. When something inside slips, it often shows up on the outside first. If your face or hands didn't look like you anymore, it wasn't cosmetic. It's your body leaking clues. If you want to watch more video like this, subscribe to my channel. See you.